गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम इन एस एस टी क्लास टूडे इन एस एस टी क्लास वी विल डिस्कस चैप्टर नंबर सेवन इंडिया आर ब्यूटिफुल कंट्री एस ऑल ऑफ यू नो डैट वी ऑल लिव इन इंडिया इंडिया इज आ मदर लैंड इट इज वेरी बिग एंड ब्यूटिफुल कंट्री लेट स्टार्ट The chapter, chapter number seven, India, our beautiful country. India is a very big and beautiful country, but land surface of our country is not same everywhere. It varies from place to place look at the map we see various landforms we see various landforms and water bodies and water bodies shown in different color like here third desert is represented in brown color northern plain is represent in green color in this way they use different color to show mountains plains desert and coastline they use different color to show mountain desert plains plateaus and coast line dear students In this chapter we will learn about mountains plateaus plains and desert First of all we will learn about mountain First of all we will learn the meaning of mountain Mountain is a landform that rises Mountain is a landform that rises high above its surrounding land and this and this is the highest point of the mountain and known as peak dear student mountain is a landform that rises high above its surrounding area and this highest point conical shape beta this highest point of the mountain is called peak students do you know the great himalayas form the northern boundary of our country mount everest is the highest mountain peak in this region the height of mount everest is about 8848 meter many rivers like ganga yamuna satluj and brahmaputra start from these mountain or originate from mountains many rivers like ganga yamuna satluj Brahmaputra originate from mountains Look at this picture this picture shows plain area this picture shows plain area dear students plain are broad flat and level land the river ganga and yamuna flow through these plain these river make the land surface very fertile these river make the land surface very fertile plains are thickly populated means large number of people live here because soil is good for farming 
farming soil is good for farming here easy to construct road and railways and good transport and communication facilities are also available here this is the picture of plateau this is the picture of plateau first of all i will tell you the meaning of plateau plateau is a land that rises plateau is a land that rises high above its surrounding land plateau is a land that rises high above its surrounding area but has a table like surface but has a table like surface means upper part this part upper part is smooth like a table look at this picture this part is smooth na that's why say plateau is table land that's why we also say plateau is a table land the deccan plateau occupies the largest part of india desert look at this picture this is picture of desert area these are the region that receive very little rainfall and barren here days are very hot because sand heats quickly that's why days are hot and nights are cold because sand cools down quickly this region receive very less rainfall or no rainfall that's why very few trees are found here look at this picture where only cactus and thorny bushes are found here this is the picture of island island is a land that is surrounded by water from all the side island is a land that is surrounded by water from all the side example andaman and nicobar island and lakshadweep island in india look at this map of india dear student southern part of india look at this is southern part of india southern part of india is surrounded by three water body on the west it is surrounded by arabian sea on the east it is surrounded by bay of bengal and in the south it is surrounded by indian ocean that's why southern part of india is also known as peninsula peninsula is a land that is surrounded by water from three side southern part of india is also known as peninsula because southern part of india is surrounded by water bodies from three side on the west it is surrounded by arabian sea on the east it is surrounded by bay of bengal and in the south it is surrounded by indian ocean andaman and nicobar island look here andaman and nicobar island lies in the bay of bengal and lakshadweep island lies in the arabian sea homework time revise this topic thank you have a nice day jai hind